and welcome to the first vlog of 2022 for the Ginger John Charlie Coffee Cup. Today, I bring you a vlog from the top of an NCP car park. Wow, Paul, I tuned in for this. Well, I've not just brought you on top of here for the fun of it. I brought you on top of here for the view that you get from the top of it. And that Northern service is going to crew. Oh look, there's a new one as well. But a lot of the old stock is still on Northern rails. And I think we're about to get a fly past. Time for the cross country service from Bournemouth. And if you just look about there through the grates, there's one of Northern's depots. Not as big as the one in Moston, but a couple of newer units are in there. Apart from being on the platforms, this is probably the best view you get of the station. I mean, it's an unobstructed view of the viaduct as well as trains coming in and out and the landing run for 23 right at Manchester Airport. I mean when I first moved to Stockport this multi-story didn't exist. But as you can see yeah I'm on the sixth floor and it's between me and a car. That's it. Last time I used this multi-story car park was towards the end of last year when I finally got married. So yeah, it's quite a nice vantage point. But there's not really much going on up here, so how about we take a trip down there and go onto the platforms. Now, Stockport is my local station, and I'm pretty sure most of you know who watch the channel regularly. And it's also, not that I've told you before, one of the stations in England that has a platform zero. And I was literally just up there. <laughs> But now, let's go into Stockport Station and see if we can get on one of the platforms. Through those doors there is platform zero. But as you can see, I'm not getting on that today, and even if I wanted to, they blocked it off. Shame really, I mean, I've seen it open a few times in the past few weeks, but not recently, unfortunately. When I eventually do the platform zero challenge of Great Britain, I'm gonna need it to be open. I might try and ask them to see when they're going to reopen it, but when they do reopen it, we'll be doing the Platform Zero Challenge from Edinburgh all the way to Cardiff, or vice versa. And there's a lot of trains, but the one platform that we're probably not seeing trains today is Platform 3A. Now, I did a video quite early on in this, in this channel where we got a train from Platform 3A all the way to Saley Bridge. Probably going to have to redo that now with the service now back up and running after Covid. But coming in on platform 2 is an Avanti West Coast Pendolino. Now, during today's video, I thought I'd give you an idea or a flavour as to what's coming up on this channel in 2022. Excuse the noise of the Avanti West Coast there, I do apologise. Manchester Airport's going to feature more than it has done previously. Trains are still going to be on here. The only big vlog currently that is a definite, well, I hope it's a definite, is the December trip to Florida for the honeymoon. Yes, I'm still doing videos on my honeymoon. I love yous. Obviously, I have got a few ideas of some big ones like the Platform Zero Challenge, like I just mentioned before. I've also got an idea of giving my missus £200 to send me to airports around Europe on some of the cheapest flights you can get. The next train to arrive on Platform 1 is 
but at the minute it's all if, buts and maybes. And you know, when I've got a more concrete view of what 2022 looks like, you'll be the first to know on this channel. You will be the first to know. I'll put it on my Instagram as to like if I've got any plans or where I'm going to be up to because you sit there and watch my videos yes it might only be for two three minutes you know to me that's amazing because when i first started this i generally did not think i'd get 60 people subscribed to my channel and to those 60 people and just to casual watchers of the channel thank you so much your support means a lot it's kind of cool we were literally just up there and now we're on the platforms of stockport station now just to give you an idea there's a sandwich shop around there dubway smith obviously Starbucks is there, although it's closed today. As the TP Express Class 185 comes in. That box there is a lift. Similar one to that. Oh, another Northern Rail. There's a waiting room just over there. And the Station Master's office is around there. Platform 3A is here. <laughs> Sat here, looking at trains and looking around Stockport Station. I mean, I'm here more than I'm at home. I actually want to, in the comments, any train station you'd love me to come and see. I mean, we've done Carlisle, we've done Sheffield, we've done Manchester, Piccadilly, and we've done Stockport. This will be, the, I think it's the second one here. Uh, We've been to Doncaster, no, not stayed. Leeds, pretty much the same. Newcastle as well. So, in the comments, any train train station you want me to come and visit, put it in the comments, and uh, if it's viable and I can do it, I'll, I'll come. Now, those keen watchers of the channel will know I've gone to London on Avanti West Coast. LNER. There's one service I really want to catch. In fact, I know there's two. I'll tell you, there's two. One is Lumo, and I can't wait to go on them. And the other one is East Midlands Railway, because when I was at Sheffield and we saw those brilliant intercity trains, I really want to go on those. So hopefully London again will be on the channel this year. Speaking of East Midlands Railway... I did not know that was going to happen, honestly. East Midlands Railway goes that way, cross country goes that way. I love the voyages, I think they're such a nice train. So yeah, a couple of videos I really want to do this year, so honestly, keep up my Instagram, I'll uh, maybe think it's down to Twitter, I'm not sure yet. But yeah, keep across the channel see what's going on but anyway back to the trains so this is the current break in the trains I mean the cross country is still here but I'm on the west coast is yet to turn up I actually looked at something like, what is the longest train journey you can get that starts in Manchester? Now I thought it was Edinburgh. I was wrong. I then thought it was Milford Haven in Wales. I was wrong again. 
it's actually on board that train. We get the train from Manchester to Southampton, no, Bournemouth, sorry. You've actually gone on the longest train journey that you can do from Manchester Piccadilly. I've got to do that, haven't I? <laughs> I love my train journeys. <laughs> Next train rolling to Stockport Station on this Bank Holiday Monday is the Transport for Oil Service to Carmarthen. Better than what it was the other day, I mean it was only going as far as crew. <laughs> Opening the line slowly again, I see. these lights would make up what they're doing. One minute they're on, next minute they're off. What's going on here? So anyway, Happy New Year to everyone who watches this video. I hope your 2022 is better than your previous years. One thing I do know is this channel is going to have a video every single week of it and I'm going to really thoroughly enjoy making them for you, the watching public. Honestly, I can't wait for you to see the adventures we get up to. Now, should we get the obligatory Northern Rail service? There. As we know, Transfer and Express are the Novas. And we haven't been on all the sets as of yet. There's one set that they have that goes from Liverpool Lime Street to Scarborough. And part of it is pulled by the, lo the locomotives known as the Big Cats. Well, we've seen a lot of them go through stations we've been to, but we've never been on one. But in 2022, that's one of the vlogs I really want to do. Get pulled behind one of them big cats on Trenland Express services from Liverpool to Scarborough. East Midlands and Northern. <laughs> race to the set of points by the northern and east midlands i think is a perfect way to end today's video i mean give it any longer and i think we might get a bit of a thunderstorm you can't see on the camera but there's very thick black clouds over there but anyway i do hope you've enjoyed this shortish vlog to start 2022 many more vlogs to come over the next 52 weeks so i do hope you enjoyed it if you did please like share comment subscribe Hit notification bell to know this new video. I mean, the coffee cup will see you in the next one.